Welcome to the second video in our series about endometriosis. We will discuss how endometriosis, a condition that affects about 1 million females in Canada, is one of the major causes of pain with deep vaginal penetration, also called deep dyspnea. Deep dyspnea affects approximately 50% of people with endometriosis. Endometriosis often grows in the posterior cul-de-sac, also called the pouch of Douglas, the space between the uterus and the bowel. It has been linked to higher levels of estrogen and an increase in nerve cells. An increase of estrogen can lead to inflammation, while the increase in nerve cells often causes pain. Together, the inflammation and increase in nerve cells may cause tenderness of the pelvic area. When having penetrative sex, this tender area can be hit and can cause deep dyspnea. Watch the next video in our series to learn more about painful sex caused by central sensitization. Contact your healthcare provider if you have concerns about endometriosis or painful sex. Welcome to the third video in our series about endometriosis. In our previous videos, we discussed what endometriosis is, how it occurs, and the symptoms people with it experience, as well as how endometriosis can cause pain during deep vaginal penetration, also called deep dyspnea. In this video, we will focus on deep dyspnea, a common symptom in people with endometriosis. In this example, direct contact with tissues affected by endometriosis is the immediate cause of deep dyspnea. However, endometriosis can also be an indirect cause of painful sex. Other things related to endometriosis may also cause painful sex, one of which is central sensitization. Central sensitization is caused by changes to the central nervous system, which includes the brain and spinal cord. Brain and spinal cord cells become highly sensitized or excited, which cause them to amplify the normal signals we receive from our senses. Even a light touch may be felt as pain. Central sensitization can occur in different people, including those with endometriosis. This pain is real, it is not in your head. In this circumstance, the pain is not caused by direct contact with the endometriosis. The endometriosis is the trigger that leads to central sensitization, which in turn results in pain in other areas, like the bladder or pelvic floor muscles. So imagine the fires of sensitization are out of control. The goal is to extinguish the fire and reduce the pain. In order to determine which treatment will be most beneficial, it is important to identify the specific cause of painful sex in people with endometriosis. Endometriosis medications or surgery may not help pain due to central sensitization. For example, some people may still experience deep dyspnea even after the removal of their endometriosis. Central sensitization is complex. Other treatments, such as physiotherapy, psychological therapy, including cognitive behavioral therapy and mindfulness, or medications may help. Contact your healthcare provider if you have concerns about endometriosis or painful sex.